Hi, ho guys and gals, it's Red, your friendly neighborhood tool bear back again here in the old den of tools. And Black and Decker has done it. They've listened to you and they have come out with what they feel is the ultimate new line of power tools for DIYers. All right, for the weekend warrior types, this is going to be it. This is this is the way going forward, the way it's going to be. So let's jump into it and see what they have for us. Now, I will admit, I originally thought this was going to be in Europe only, but they've announced now coming out for the u.s tools to build a better planet black and decker announces retail launch for reviva 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 i think it's reviva the brand's first sustainably led power tool line i don't know what they mean by sustainably led but it's made from sustainable products let's Let's, let's put it that way. They use the Triton Renew Plastics system so that 50% or more of the products are from certified recycled content. Not sure who certifies this stuff. And they also work with TerraCycle so that at the end of the day, things can be returned and recycled. So, you know, from beginning to end, even the cardboard the box ships in, is fully recycled now this line they're going to have a, a, a smaller start i think there's like six or seven tools to start with clearly designed to help you lead your best instagram life uh all sorts of stuff you can do with you and your partner look at that they look so so pleased with themselves and all the instagram projects they're going to work on oh look look <laughs> He's so proud of her using power tools. They're not going to get canceled for this at all. No, anyway, let's look at this. We, I see a drill driver. We got a screwdriver. We got a sander, a vacuum, a multi-tool, a jigsaw, and what I'm going to guess is a hammer drill. Um, anyway, so let's jump over because they have them right now on Amazon. So let's take a look at the first one. If you've been around the channel, you know I've kind of chatted about these before. But this is the first time we have just confirmation that they are gonna. There is gonna be a U.S. launch, and here it is uh, launching via Amazon. We have the Black and Decker drill. This is a 12 volt system. Okay, they do have a, a four volt option as well. But this is the 12 volt drill right here, and this is your basic, nice, small. You know, just fits right in the paw kind of handheld drill there. Uh, it. I mean, it's a nice, sleek looking design. I. I got to say, it looks nice. And not Look how thin that is. Got to be a real pleasure to work with. One thing I do note is that that looks like a charging port right there. And if you saw the, the picture before, that's exactly what it is because the batteries in these are internal. I don't see a way to easily remove them. Now, I did check and I read through all of Black & Decker's stuff, and they do say that the internal battery design enables easy removal. I... I that is as oxymoron of a statement as I've ever seen. I don't see any nuts or screws or anything holding this thing together, which means I'm doing what? Getting a butter knife out and cracking the plastic open? Maybe just hit it on the on the counter and it just shatters and you have easy access to the battery. I don't know what they mean by easy access to the internal workings when you want to recycle it but that said they do say it can be recycled i mean it's a battery it can be recycled i'm going to be honest here when i look at this what i don't see is i don't see a a, a tool that's really designed for recyclability so much as a tool that has used recyclability as an excuse for planned obsolescence this is a disposable tool They've made it easy for you to dispose of it. They've made it guilt-free for you to dispose of it. So then you have to turn around and buy an, an entirely different drill. When your battery dies at fifty for $58, you're going to plop down another 58 bucks for a whole nother tool. And it just seems like this is, I don't know, it's not the most sustainable. Here's another, here's an idea for sustainability. How about buy a tool that's just going to last? Why don't you get yourself a, if you really care about sustainability, get yourself corded tools. Don't worry about batteries. This DeWalt, with it's got a key. This is an old school. This is like your grandpa's kind of drill. This thing will last forever. In fact, I, I bet 10 bucks you sold his like in the estate sale after he passed away or something because it outlasted him. These drills will last you a lifetime. You never have to worry about recycling because they'll keep working. All right. Now, their other option here is the jigsaw. This is a cute little jigsaw. Uh, at least it's not a barrel grip. $68 on that. It's, it, I don't know, the foot on it looks awfully small. It doesn't pivot at all. So you're stuck with a flat-footed jigsaw. 
That's obnoxious. Uh, $68. Or for $64, you can buy a Porter cable with the, look at this, with the orbital uh, options here. Do the other one have the orbital options on it? I don't see any orbital options on that one. So I got a flat foot orbital options and all of 12 volt power, or I can plug in, not worry about batteries, have orbital settings, have a tilting foot and have a real tool. You could do all sorts of stuff with this tool. Um, I, okay. How about this multi-tool? It's, it looks like a nice, small, versatile multi-tool for 70, 80 bucks. Let's call it. Or I get the Craftsman for 89. That thing is a beast of a tool. Will last you a lifetime. Will probably, again, outlive you. And it'll do all sorts of stuff. It even comes with a nice little bag there. You can throw the rest of your tools in. How about this little sander? Wow, that is a tiny little kind of mouse kind of sander there, which makes sense because Black & Decker invented the mouse detail sander for $37 versus, what's the price on this one? Let's see all buying options. I bet it's cheap. Oh, look, $71. $71. Or for a disposable recyclable tool or for a tool that will actually last and I'll keep using. I'm not this is not a professional grade tool, but for the kind of person who's buying this, this tool will last last them a lifetime. It really will. Now this one, the handheld dust vac, that's kind of funny because Black and Decker already makes this exact same model. It just doesn't have the little green parts on it and say Reviva or Reviva or whatever it is. And it's, it's a, the, I think there's a dollar, you're paying a dollar more for the recycled version. Maybe that's a good option there. Maybe that's when you want to go. Or you could just get a wet dry vac and some 25 foot of cord for $61. 63, I, I think I'm going to get more use out of this. I don't know about you. Um, and then last but not least in the line, at least what they currently have on Amazon, is the Black & Decker screwdriver. Now this is, you see here, it's highlighted four volt screwdriver there. So they do make one that's just like this in black and orange, and it I think it's like a dollar less. So again, maybe this, if you're really concerned about it, that's an option because the other one isn't really recyclable or anything. I totally get that. Here's another option. If you, you're like, because I hear you, you're like, Bear, you know, I like the options you gave us, and you're right about corded versus cordless. I want to be, I want to be green. I want to feel good about the planet. But you know what? I still want that cordless option. Well, then here, do this. Get yourself the Black & Decker Matrix. You see, I own this. I bought this myself uh, back in 2020. The Black & Decker Matrix system. What this is, is it's basically the drill, but the part that does the work, uh, not the motor part, the part that does work, that is modular. So you have one, one you know, battery platform. You have one core tool. So you're not buying five or six or seven of these. That's got to be way more green than that Reviva system. And you get yourself, look at this, with that one package for $100, you are getting a jigsaw, a router, an impact, a multi-tool, and a sander, as well as the drill, all the extra pads, a battery, a case, the whole nine yards for $184. Uh, in fact, you know what? They even have it in white, if you prefer. <laughs> you know what else they got? They have this. This is the corded version of that same drill. So if you don't want to use the battery system and you want all those options for $40 more, you can get the corded base for it. Oh, and guess what? They have other stuff. They have a circ saw for you. They've got the hammer drill for you. They've got a buffer for you. We got a detail sander, a little finger sander. There, there's a better photo of it. A little finger sander there for you. What else we got? We got a high flow inflator. We got, uh, was it a shrub, hedge, grass, edger, trimmer thing? Uh, we have a high pressure inflator. Oh, what else? We got even shears. We got scissors. What, what more do you want? Oh, a recip saw? They've got that too, with a storage case to throw it all in. In fact, you can buy the big jumbo kit here for $369. I'm sorry, but this is, you know what? It's a pretty system. Don't get me wrong. That is a very attractive, well-made, well-marketed system for the people they're trying to target, which is, I'm guessing, mostly like apartment dwellers and people who are super, super worried about being green and want to be DIY and want to post all their stuff on TikTok and Instagram and whatnot. And I get it. I totally get it. All right. But, you know, and as a bear, I live in the woods. I, I want it to stay green. I, 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 I want all of that. But at some point in time, you have to say, is this really a solution to that problem? Are they really trying to fix it? Would it be better to go with something that is a disposable, recyclable system? 
Or would it be better to just buy something that lasts? Or maybe instead buy something that is smarter about the way you do it. Anyway, that's just the Bears Two Cents. You all take care. God bless. And as always, say it with me. Shine on.